You know, every year we plant a lot of biologic food plots, and some years you really don't know what to anticipate in terms of what are the local farmers around the property going to be doing. It may be too wet for them to get their beans out, or there may be, you know, a corn crop standing. So once those plots germinate, sometimes you go in anticipation of, boy, they ought to be murdering this food plot, but they're not hitting it as hard. And you've got to kind of back up and take a look around at what's going on. And mass crop can also be a big contributor. There can be as, as much as 800 pounds of acorns that will fall per acre over about a 30-day period. So you multiply that if you've got 20 or 30 acres of, or more of hardwoods, that's a lot of mass crop that's out there. And those deer are going to concentrate on that mass first. But at some point, if there's no mass crop, the food plots will be the hottest place on your property to hunt. They will murder your food plots early. And that can be a good thing from a hunting perspective, and it can be a bad thing from a gamekeeper perspective when you're trying to make sure you've got enough groceries to last throughout the whole winter. So go into the fall, plant as much as you can. Just watch what's going on around you. If you don't have utilization right off the bat, you know, look at some of the other factors that are going on around you. If you've got a scenario where you don't have a mass crop, go get ready because that food plot is going to be the hottest spot on your property.